In this video, I'll give you a brief introduction to every single Chinese car logos you might see on the streets of China. This is likely to be the most comprehensive video about Chinese car brands on the internet. So after you finish this video, you won't find yourself scratching your head at those unfamiliar car badges like I did. There are hundreds of Chinese car brands, they come and go quite rapidly. If a car brand that has gone bankrupt or is no longer selling in the market for any reason, it won't be discussed in this video. The brands that are not originated from China will also not be discussed. After that, we still have over 100 of different brands to talk about. It is a challenge to make this video entertaining, but I'll do my best to increase the audience retention, like with this intense music and progress meter here. Now let's get started. Let's first look at BYD Auto Company, a prominent Chinese automaker known for its electric vehicles and energy solutions. Established in 2003, it plays a significant role in the global electric vehicle market, offering a diverse range of electric cars, buses, and batteries. BYD owns four other brands, each with its own badge, Denza Yangwang, Fang Chengbao, and the Dynasty Series. Denza, a luxury electric car brand, was founded in May 2010 by Shenzhen BYD New Energy Company, a joint venture between BYD Auto and the Mercedes-Benz Group. Yangwang is another luxury electric car brand owned by BYD, launched in January 2023. Fang Chengbao, or Formula Cheetah in English, is a new sub-brand of BYD, officially announced on June 9, 2023, and is the fifth brand in the BYD brand matrix. The Dynasty series, on the other hand, consists of plug-in hybrid electric vehicles. Each car in this series has its own logo, named after ancient Chinese dynasties like Han, Tong, Song, Yuan, and Qing. Still watching? Good, I'm glad you're still here. Thank you for staying with me. Now, let's move on to Geely. Geely is a well-known Chinese automaker that has rapidly expanded in the global automotive market. They have acquired renowned companies like Volvo, Lotus, and more. Founded in 1997, Geely manufactures a variety of vehicles from compact cars to luxury sedans. Its logo, inspired by the abs of a man, symbolizes the vitality of strong men and women. An interesting approach, to say the least. Under Geely, there are eight car series with different logos. Link & Co, Geometry, Radar, Jidu, Maple, Farizon, Geely Galaxy, Tangjun, and Livon. Link & Co, established in Gothenburg in 2016, is a Chinese-Swedish automobile brand owned by Geely Automobile Holdings. This brand focuses on internet connectivity and innovative purchasing models, appealing to a young professional audience. Geometry, launched in April 2019 by Geely, concentrates on developing electric vehicles. Geely Radar is a sub-brand of the Chinese automaker Geely that focuses on electric pickup trucks. The first product truck from Radar was launched in 2022. Jidu Auto, a joint venture between Baidu and Geely founded in March 2021, focuses on creating smart electric vehicles. It combines Geely's automotive expertise with Baidu's technology, targeting the Chinese market. Maple, established in 2000, was originally known as Shanghai Maple Automobiles. In 2022, it was revived as a sub-brand of Levan Automotive. Farizon Auto, started in 2014 by Geely's New Energy Commercial Vehicles Group, is a commercial vehicle brand specializing in new energy. Geely Galaxy, a new high-end electrified product series, was launched by Geely Auto Group in February 2023. Tangjun, founded in 1956 as Zebo Automobile and acquired by Geely in January 2021, is part of Geely's new energy commercial vehicle group. Finally, Livan Automotive, established in January 2022, is a joint venture between Geely and Leafan Technology. It focuses on mid-range priced sedans and SUVs with battery swapping functionality. The brand emerged in 2022 after merging Maple and Leafan Technology. The next major car company we'll talk about is Sherry. Founded in 1997, Sherry is currently the ninth largest automobile manufacturer in China, producing over 1.2 million vehicles in 2022. Under the Sherry brand, there are five subsidiaries, QQ, iCar, Exit, Carry, Jeto, Coros, and Kawin. Sherry QQ is a series of city cars produced by Chinese automobile manufacturer Sherry Automobile. The first of the series was the QQ hatchback in 2003. Sherry QQ Ice Cream is the latest model of QQ series. It's a three-door electric car that starts at around $6,500. Sherry iCar is a Chinese electric compact crossover SUV produced by Sherry under the iCar brand. The vehicle was first presented in 2023. Apple tried to buy this brand name from Sherry, but it was denied, and the iCar did not support Apple CarPlay. Exceed, introduced by Sherry in September 2017, is a premium sport utility vehicle division focusing on high-end SUVs. 
Carry, a Chinese car manufacturer founded by Sherry in 2009, specializes in light commercial vehicles and people carriers for passenger transport. Notably, their logo looks quite similar to Ford's. JTour, another subsidiary of Cherry, produces SUVs and crossover vehicles. Launched in 2018, JTour aims to provide stylish and practical SUV options for a wide range of consumers. Koros Auto, headquartered in Shanghai, was established in December 2007 as a joint venture between Cherry and Israel Corporation. Originally named Cherry Quantum Automotive Corporation, it was rebranded as Koros Auto in November 2011. Finally, Kawin Auto, established in March 2014, is a subsidiary of Sherry Automobile. Cowan Auto manufactures both traditional and new energy vehicles, offering a series of sedans and crossovers based on older Cherry platforms. Who? let me grab some water. Okay, let's continue. Next up is Chang and Automobile, a Chinese state-owned automobile manufacturer. It's the smallest of China's big four state-owned car manufacturers, which includes Saek Motor, FR Group, Dongfeng Motor Corporation, and Chang and Automobile. Chang'an's history dates back to 1862 as a military supply factory. Chang'an Auto has joint ventures with brands like Mazda, Ford, and Suzuki. Under Chang'an Auto, there are Avata, Dipal, Kaiching, Oshan, Chiwan, and Lumin. Chang'an Avata is the electric automotive manufacturing company founded in 2018, a joint venture between Chang'an and Nio. Dipal, owned by Chang'an Automobile, was initially Chongqing Chang'an New Energy Automobile Technology. It became an independent brand in 2023. Kaizen Auto is a Chinese car brand that produces and sells commercial trucks and vans that are slightly more expensive than the Chang'an Kuayue, which is another brand under Chang'an with the identical badge, founded in 1999, but are still generally considered to be quite affordable. The company was founded in 2019 and is a subsidiary of Chang'an Automobile. Oshan, previously known as Chang'an Commercial Vehicles, focused on microvans and light trucks. In April 2017, it was rebranded as Chang'an Oshan and shifted to producing passenger vehicles. Shiyuan, launched by Chang'an Automobile in August 2023, is a new brand specializing in electric and hybrid cars. Chang'an Lumen, introduced in April 2022 with its debut in June 2022, is a city car by Chang'an Automobile. It's an affordable electric car targeted at the domestic Chinese market, with a starting price of under $7,000. Let's move on to Great Wall Motors. This major Chinese automotive company, known for its SUVs and pickup trucks, was founded in 1984. Great Wall has grown into one of the largest and most successful private automotive manufacturers in China, with a significant global presence. There are five separate brands with their own logo owned by Great Wall Motor. Great Wall Conon, Haval, Tank, Wei and Aura. Great Wall Cannon is a range of mid-sized luxury pickup trucks manufactured by Great Wall Motors since 2019. Havel, established in 2013 under Great Wall Motors, is recognized for its SUVs. It has quickly become one of the top SUV brands in China, known for combining style with off-road capabilities. Tank, launched on March 21, 2021, is another brand owned by Great Wall Motors. They specialize in off-roading SUVs similar to brands like Jeep or Bronco. Tank vehicles have a commanding road presence, often compared to G-Wagons. Way is Great Wall Motors' luxury SUV brand introduced in 2016. It focuses on premium crossovers and SUVs. Lastly, Aura, launched in 2018 by Great Wall Motors, specializes in electric vehicles. Known for their modern and distinctive design, Aura aims to offer affordable yet stylish electric cars. Their cars, often seen on the roads, are super cute and remind me of VW Beetles. There is another sub-sub brand under Aura called Sar, which has its own badge. I'm not sure if you'll ever see it on the road, but I have to talk about it, because their car is crazy looking. It was introduced in 2021 in Guangzhou. Wow, you must really be interested in cars, there's more coming. Shanghai Automotive Industry Corporation, or CIC Motor Corporation, is a Chinese state-owned automobile manufacturer, founded in 1955. It's the largest of China's big four state-owned car manufacturers. Asaic Motor doesn't produce vehicles under its own brand, but has joint ventures with foreign brands like General Motors, VW, Skoda, Buick, and Cadillac. Under Saic Motor, there are six different badges. Maxus, Rowaway, Aya Motor, Rising Auto, Wuling, and Baojun. Saic Maxus, established in 2011, is a Chinese vehicle brand that manufactures commercial and passenger vehicles. It operates globally as a wholly owned subsidiary of Saic Motor. Rowi, created in 2006 by Saic Motor, focuses on luxury cars. 
initially based on technology from the defunct British car maker MG Rover, Rowe now incorporates a lot of technology from General Motors. I am Motor, established in 2020, is a joint venture between Sai Group and Alibaba Group. This brand specializes in luxury electric vehicles. Rising Auto, originally called R Brand in 2020, is an offshoot of Sai Rowe dedicated to new energy and intelligent vehicles. Known in Chinese as Feifan Auto, it was renamed Rising Auto in October 2021. Wuling, founded in 1982, is a joint venture between Seik Motor, General Motors, and Liuzhou Wuling Motors. It's known for producing affordable and practical vehicles, including microvans and electric cars. Finally, Baojun, established in 2010, is a joint venture between General Motors and Seik Motor. It was created as a more affordable alternative to GM's Chevrolet and Buick brands, which are also sold in China. Getting bored yet? Hang in there, we're only a third of the way through. GIC Group, or Guangzhou Automobile Group, is a Chinese state-owned automobile manufacturer based in Guangzhou, Guangdong. Founded in 1955, it's the fifth largest automobile manufacturer in China. It has joint ventures with Honda, Toyota, Hino, Mitsubishi, and Fiat. GIC Group produces and sells a variety of vehicles under its own brands, like Trumpchi and Empo. But there are three more distinct brands under its umbrella, Ion, Hi-Fi, and Hi-Can. Ion, established in 2017 as a sub-brand under GAC New Energy, became a standalone brand in 2020. This company produces and sells fully electric sedans and crossovers. Hi-Fi, launched in July 2017, is a subsidiary of GAC Group. It represents the electric hypercar department of the group. Hi-Can, founded in 2019 as a joint venture between GAC Group, Ion and NIO, focuses on fully electric sedans and crossovers. NIO is a Chinese company that makes electric cars. It was founded in 2014 by William Lee. The company has raised over 5 billion from investors and has plans to expand to 25 different countries and regions by 2025. NIO's first model, the NIO EP9, debuted on the same day the brand was established. The company has developed battery swapping stations for its vehicles as an alternative to conventional charging stations. FAW, also known as China First Automobile Works or First Automobile Works, is a prominent state-owned automobile manufacturer in China. Founded on July 15, 1953, FOW stands as the second largest of the big four state-owned car manufacturers in China. FOW has joint ventures with several Western manufacturers, such as Audi, Mazda, Toyota, and VW. FOW produces a lot of cars under their own brand, but they also have three sub-brands that having their own logos. They are Honki, Honki New Energy, Bishun, and FOW VW Jetta. Honki, meaning red flag in Chinese, is a brand that I personally find has one of the most unique and elegant logos in the world. Established in 1958 as part of the Vaux Group, Honki is a historic luxury car brand, synonymous with prestige and elegance in China. The brand is renowned for its premium sedans and limousines, often used in official state events. Honki's new energy department also has very good looking logo, it is another brand under Vaux Group, founded on January 8, 2023. The brand is committed to promoting new energy vehicles, including pure electric sedans, SUVs, and more. Essentially, this brand is still honky, but since it has a exclusively designed logo, I have to introduce it here. Bestune, originally founded in 2006 as Bestune and renamed in 2018, is another automotive marque owned by Fog Group. The company produces budget passenger vehicles and operates primarily in China. The last one might sound a little crazy, but Jetta is an individual brand launched by Volkswagen Group with its joint venture partner Fall Group in 2019. The Volkswagen Jetta is a popular car in China, and the model forms the basis of the new company, with two additional SUV models joining the range. The next major Chinese car manufacturer is Dongfeng Motor, a Chinese state-owned automobile manufacturer headquartered in my hometown Wuhan. It was founded in 1969. Dongfeng Motor Corporation is currently the third largest of the big four. Voya, Venusia, Fothing, and Fenggon are the brands owned or partially owned by Dongfeng. Dongfeng has joint adventure with Citroën, Peugeot, Honda, Nissan, and Kia. Voya is a high-end electric vehicle brand launched by Dongfeng Motor in 2020. The brand's Chinese name Lantu is derived from the Chinese word means blueprint. The brand is expected to compete with other high-end EV brands. Venucha is a car mark of Dongfeng Nissan Passenger Vehicle Company. Launched in September 2010 by Dongfeng Nissan, Venucha specializes in producing electric and hybrid vehicles. Dongfeng Forthing is an automobile mark owned by the Chinese automaker Dongfeng Liuzhou Moto, a division of Dongfeng Motor Group. 
It was launched in 2001 under the name Fengxing and was later renamed to Forthing as the English name. Dongfeng Fengon is a brand that offers affordable compact MPVs and SUVs. Established in 2008, it was initially a joint venture with Dengfeng Group but was fully acquired by Ceres Group in 2022. You won't see cars under Ceres brand, but I have to introduce this company because it owns a lot of other Chinese car brands. Ceres was founded in 1986 in Chongqing, China. Formerly known as Socon Group, focus on household appliance components. It rebranded to Ceres in 2022 and shifted to manufactures electric vehicles, motorcycles, commercial vehicles, shock absorbers, and engines. Landian, Ruichi, and Eito are car brands owned or partially owned by Ceres. Landian, a sub-brand of the Ceres Group dedicated to new energy vehicles, was officially launched on March 30th, 2023. The brand's first model, the plug-in hybrid E5, features technology from both Huawei and BYD. Ruichi, an electric vehicle maker established in September 2003 in Chongqing, specializes in commercial vehicles including electric ones. It operates as a fully funded subsidiary of the Ceres Group. AITO is a Chinese electric vehicle mark of Chinese multinational technology corporation Huawei and vehicle manufacturer Ceres Group. The brand was launched in December 2021. A lot of Chinese cars advertise they run Harmony OS in their entertainment system, which is also the selling point of this car. Interesting enough, almost all Chinese cars doesn't support CarPlay or Android Auto. BAIC, or Beijing Automotive Industry Holding Company, is a major state-owned automotive company in China. With a history dating back to 1958, BAIC is involved in the production of a wide range of vehicles, from passenger cars to commercial trucks. BAIC has joint adventure with Hyundai and Benz. They also sell a lot of different cars under their own badge. Under BAIC, there are two sub-brands you could see on the road. They are ArcFox and Photon. Arc Fox is a Chinese marco of electric passenger cars and crossovers based in Beijing, operating since 2017. Photon Motor is a Chinese company that designs and manufactures trucks, buses, and sport utility vehicles. It was founded on August 28, 1996. The company is headquartered in Changping, Beijing. Alright guys, we're finally about halfway through. Jack Motors, also known as Anhui Jianghuai Automobile, is a state-owned Chinese automobile and commercial vehicle manufacturer. Founded in 1964, with its headquarters in Hefei, Anhui Province, China, Jack Motors produces a diverse range of vehicles, including passenger cars, commercial vehicles, and buses. Under Jack Motors, there is one sub-brand with its own badge, and that is Sihao. Sihao was launched on 2018 by Seat and JAC Volkswagen joint venture. It was originally positioned as a brand for pure electric vehicles. However, in 2020, the Volkswagen Group increased its stake to 75% and officially renamed it Volkswagen Anhui. As of 2021, Sihao has been licensed for use by JAC, essentially making it no longer a joint venture brand. The next major brand is JMC. JMC stands for Jiangling Motors Corporation, a manufacturer that was founded in Nanchang, China in 1952. JMC primarily designs, manufactures and sells minibuses, pickup trucks and other vehicles. JMC has had joint ventures with Ford Motors since 1997. Under JMC, there are two notable sub-brands, JMEV and Jingma Motor. JMEV focuses on developing and producing electric cars. Established in 2015 as a subsidiary of Jiangling Motors Corporation Group, it underwent a transformation in July 2019. JMEV was reorganized as a joint venture between JMCG, Renault, and the China Agricultural Development Construction Fund Corporation, following Renault's acquisition of a majority stake. Jingma Motor is a Chinese automobile company that was founded in 2011 as a subsidiary of JMC, mainly produces buses and specialized cars, which is a joint venture between Jiangling Motors and Ford Motor Company. Brilliance Auto, a state-owned Chinese automobile manufacturer, specializes in producing passenger cars and commercial vehicles. Founded in 1992, the company is based in Shenyang, Liaoning Province, China. Brilliance Auto had two sub-brands on the market, Zinero and Jinbei. Zinero, a luxury automobile market owned by BMW Brilliance, focuses on electric vehicles. Though Jinbei has gone bankrupt, its vehicles remain common on the roads due to their past popularity. Jinbei is a Chinese automobile brand that produces minibuses based on the structure of the Toyota H100 vans in China. The brand is mainly produced by Shenyang Brilliance Jinbei Automotive. In 2017, Renault and Brilliance Auto established a joint venture called Renault Brilliance Jinbei Automotive Company, with 49% and 51% stakes respectively which went bankrupted in 2021. 
Now we have finally covered all the major manufacturers and their sub-brands in China. Next, I'll introduce the rest of 33 relatively independent brands. Some of best Chinese brands are in this category. Lujian is an automobile manufacturer from Taiwan, a subsidiary of the larger automaker Yulon Motor Company, known for building Nissan models under license. Luxgen vehicles, designed in Taiwan, have been manufactured in Hangzhou, China since 2010. Iways, founded in 2017, is a newcomer in the Chinese electric vehicle market, specializing in the development and production of electric SUVs. Weltmeister, established in January 2015 by Freeman Shen, a former executive at Geely and Volvo's China Operations, is a Chinese electric car brand focused on creating battery electric vehicles. Leap Motor, a Chinese automobile manufacturer founded in December 2015 and headquartered in Hangzhou, specializes in developing electric vehicles. The company prides itself on developing its own components, including electric traction motors, vehicle CPUs, and LED lighting. Xpeng, a Chinese electric vehicle manufacturer founded in 2015 by former Alibaba executive Xiao Peng, he and automotive veteran Hong Xia builds smart EVs that compete with Tesla's lower price models. Neta, launched in 2020 as a sub brand under Hozon Auto, focuses on electric vehicles. The brand aims to offer affordable and efficient electric cars to support the transition to sustainable transportation. Dayun Group, a Chinese conglomerate founded in 1987, produces and sells commercial vehicles such as heavy-duty trucks, light-duty trucks, and medium-duty trucks. Diandong Guo, founded in 2021 and rebranded from Shintae, which originated in 2017, mainly offers budget-friendly subcompact EVs. Xiaohu FEV is an electric city car produced by Beijing Henry Automobile Technology. It was first introduced in November 2021. Yuejin Motors Group, a Chinese automobile manufacturer established in 1955, produces commercial vehicles, passenger cars, and engines. It is now part of Shanghai Automotive Industry Corporation. Xiaomi, primarily known as a Chinese smartphone manufacturer, has announced its entry into the electric vehicle market with the Xiaomi SU7. This sedan, with 667 horsepower in the top trim, looks way too similar to Porsche and is set to begin mass production in December 2023. Suiz, a Chinese automobile manufacturer founded in November 1995 as a joint venture between China Motor Corporation and Fujian Motor Industry Group, with Mitsubishi joining in 2006. Suiz designs, develops and sells passenger cars and minibuses under its mark. Sotia Auto is a privately owned Chinese automobile manufacturer based in Yongkang, Zhejiang, China. It was established in 2005 by Zojie Holding Group. In April 2021, the company entered bankruptcy and liquidation proceedings. This is a company that makes a lot of copycat cars, no wonder they went bankrupt. However, production was reportedly restarted in December 2022. Li Auto is a Chinese startup company that designs, develops, manufactures, and sells new energy vehicles targeting the higher end. The company was founded in 2015. Li Auto's mission is to create a mobile home, create happiness through providing premium mobility solutions in the format of family-oriented cars. Sinatruk is a Chinese state-owned heavy-duty truck manufacturer headquartered in Jinan, Shandong province. It is currently the third largest truck manufacturer in mainland China. The company was founded in 1935 by the Kuomintang government of the Republic of China era on the basis of Jinan Automobile Works. Shakman is a Chinese commercial vehicle manufacturer that was established in 1968. The company is headquartered in Jinan, Shandong province, and is mainly engaged in the production of heavy-duty trucks, medium-duty trucks, and light-duty trucks. CAMC, or Hualing Xingma Automobile, is a leading Chinese manufacturer of trucks and truck-based special vehicles. The company was founded on December 12, 1999, Baiban Truck is a heavy truck manufacturer based in Baotu, Inner Mongolia, China. It was founded in 1988 when Baiban signed an agreement with Daimler Benz to manufacture Mercedes Benz trucks. Yutong is a Chinese manufacturer of commercial vehicles, especially electric buses, headquartered in Zhengzhou, Henan. It was founded in 1963 as Zhengzhou Bus Repair Factory and later renamed as Zhengzhou Yutong Bus Company in 1993. Kinglong is a Chinese manufacturer of large and medium-sized coaches and light vans. It was founded in December 1988 and is headquartered in Xiamen, China. Golden Dragon is owned by Kinglong, selling luxury buses and light vans with the trademark of Golden Dragon. It was established in 1992 and is headquartered in Xiamen as well. 
Higer Bus Company is a Chinese bus manufacturer based in Suzhou, Jiangsu Province. It was founded at the end of 1998. Skyworth Auto is a Chinese manufacturer of electric passenger vehicles based in Nanjing and operating since 2017. The brand belongs to Chinese company Skywell in partnership with Skyworth Group. Shinrei Automobile is a Chinese conglomerate that produces automobiles, motorcycles, and agricultural machinery. The company was founded in 1997. Shinrei Group is the owner of the Italian motorcycle brand SWM and has formed a joint venture with Brilliance Auto Group to produce SWM branded automobiles and motorcycles in Chongqing, China. Huanghai is a Chinese automobile manufacturer that was founded in 1951. The company is headquartered in Andong City, Liaoning Province. Huanghai primarily produces buses and has an annual production capacity of around 5,000. Shugong Automobile Manufacturing Company manufactures heavy-duty trucks, construction machinery, and other heavy equipment. The company was founded in 1943 and is headquartered in Shuzhou, Jiangsu, China. ZX Auto is a Chinese automobile manufacturer that produces SUVs and pickup trucks. It was founded in 1949 as PLA Jijong Repair Team or Automobile Repair Workshop and transformed into a joint venture company in 1999. Modern Cars is a new energy vehicle brand based in Shanghai that aims to redefine trends in the automotive industry. The company was established in 2018 and focuses on co-building with users to create a trendy lifestyle. In 2020, it unveiled its first mass-produced model and began nationwide deliveries in 2021. BAW stands for Beijing Automobile Works Company. It is a Chinese car manufacturer based in Qingdao, Shandong, produces both civilian and military vehicles, including light off-road vehicles, trucks, and passenger cars. The company was founded in 1953 and has gone through several mergers and acquisitions. In April 2023, BAW was acquired by Shandong Weqiao Pioneering Group, a private company active in the textiles and aluminium industry. Polestones is an electric vehicle startup that was founded in 2021 by Chang Jing, the CEO of Roborock, a vacuum cleaner maker. BAW manufactures the cars for this brand, making people questing the reliability because BAW is a company that's being sold several times and had no experience, produce mid to high-end cars. Yuanhang Auto is a new Chinese electric vehicle brand that was founded in 2022. It is a subsidiary of the Dayun Group, which is based in Yuncheng, Shanxi Province, China. The name Yuanhang means voyage in Chinese. Haima Automobile, a Chinese automotive company in Hainan, was founded in 1992 through a joint venture with Mazda. Initially producing Mazda models for the Chinese market, the partnership ended in 2005. Since then, Haima has navigated its own path. Before we end this video, I must confess, I knowingly ignored many Chinese brands. There are many localized brands in China, which you would often see in some towns but are non-existent in larger cities. Detailing each one individually would excessively lengthen this video. Besides, you're unlikely to encounter these brands unless you specifically visit some lesser known rural cities in China. Anyway, I'm pretty sure I covered 99% of all Chinese car badges you'll ever see on the Chinese road. Congratulations, you have finished watching this boring video. If you like it, please click the like button as that would help me a lot and consider subscribing to my channel for more random content. I'll see you next time. Bye!